<laughs> Hello Wolfpack and welcome to the lab. Now in terms of VR games, this is an oldie. It's about three years old and was probably one of the first you played when you got a VR headset. So why are we here? Well, the game just got an update. I love this game. As you can see, the index controllers are supported with these brand new hands, which is awesome. They also did a little bit of a physics update, which is really cool. I just love touching things, having feedback on different hands. Ugh, that's neat. But what we're going to be doing in here today is Easter eggs. Now, a lot of people just got the index, so they might be jumping in here for the first time, and I want to show you some cool stuff. First is an Easter egg that just came with this update. We're going to be using our drone to go up to that. Oh, no, no, I said, yep, yeah, there you go. Okay, we're going to go up on this bar. This may take me an hour, so I'll, I'll edit. And we're going to knock this box off. Perfect. Got it, got it. Oh. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, beautiful. Well, it happens to be a Knuckles EV3 box. They added this up there, and there's also a few in here, which you can get to if you have a big enough play space by just clipping through this door. This machine here is for Zortex, which is an awesome, awesome game, which I recommend everyone play. But if you grab this and press this button, the game is actually a game within itself. Now this is primarily used for the credit system, but as you can see I can control the ship down there. But if you sit through this very long credit scroll, there's a little boss at the end. So I'm going to edit past this, and I'll show you that. Oh, we have made it to the end. And now there is a... Dead. Oh, I have lives. This is... It's very difficult to actually even pretend that you can beat him. But I have my laser. Let's use that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't know what happens if you manage to beat him. No! I was so close. Oh, damn it. Let me know if you guys manage to beat it and see what you can get. Right behind this Zortex machine, if you come over here, you'll see a little special marker. A rainbow marker. And you can just hop right on over to this wall. And look at the beauty of drawing with this thing. All right, I'm going to try to draw a really nice birthday hat on this wonderful T-Rex here. And we'll give it a little pom-pom at the top. Perfect. And a bunch of dots. Look, I mean, beautiful. Rainbow marker. Very cool. Over behind Longbow, you will find a little jar with little Bendy inside. And he's just a little guy in a jar. You can't get him out, despite your best efforts. But if you bring over, shit, the calibration core, he is gonna start breaking it down. I mean, look at him go, look at that dance. That's phenomenal. Good work, little dude. Holy shit. I mean, that's, that was impressive. We are gonna enter into the solar system. Wow. Isn't it beautiful? So why are we here? Great question. Because something special happens. If you take all the planets, and of course I grab that one first, and you throw them into the sun. If I can do it. Goodbye, Uranus. Goodbye, everyone on Earth. And last, but not least, Jupiter. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What? What? What horrible universe has this taken us to? What is that? This is honestly pretty creepy. Sun. White Dwarf. 
Now, there's a theory that if you kill that guy and get those black balls over here using the drone, you'll create more pocket universes. Unfortunately, the lab developers have said that theory is not true. Now to finish this off, I'm going to do... Oh, look at the physics on the wire. The last major Easter egg. These are all places you can visit, but if you go over here and stick it into the valve, you'll be able to go to a whole new world. Which is just weird. Within it, you'll find some photo geometry of an actual office in the lab. But you'll hear a beeping. And that beeping is this fire alarm. And if you pull the fire alarm, nothing happens. Or does it? <laughs> Suddenly, all of these pictures become little drones that shoot balls and you can bat them away with your ping pong paddle. <laughs> and they all go down this drain. It's like they planned for this. This is very weird, but very cool. But it's not over yet. You'll notice on the ground here, a virtual reality headset. Huh. Can you go deeper? Hello! Oh look, I'm holding my knuckles. Cool. This is an actual office here, in Valve. And if you clip a little bit, you can see a little further. Playing some PlayStation there. Got some new TVs. These are the original lighthouses, the prototypes, before we got the ones that we currently have. And there is another fire alarm, but a VR alarm. What does this one do? Now, using your controllers, you can create lasers. Or, you can summon pins to attack these balloon fiends. And there's confetti everywhere. Like, look at the fun. There are so many balloons and they're just, they just keep coming. I'm going to stay in here until I drown in balloons. Uh, this was the lab, guys. These are just some of the Easter eggs. Valve has confirmed that there are a few more that they haven't seen anyone do. So keep, you know, keep gunting. Keep uh, looking for secrets out there. But enjoy the rest of this game, too, because it is one of the best experiences in VR, and it is entirely free. I This is incredible. There are so many balloons. I, I'm just going to stay here forever. Uh, you guys have a, have a great rest of your day, and uh, till next time, Wolfpack.